The province of Ontario is heading into another lockdown. Ontario Premier Doug Ford made the announcement earlier this afternoon. He said COVID-19 case numbers are still rising and tougher restrictions are needed to protect hospitals and save lives. I'm announcing today that Ontario will enter a province-wide shutdown starting at 12.01 a.m. on December 26. This difficult action is without a doubt necessary to save lives and prevent our hospitals from being overwhelmed in the coming weeks. Make no mistake, thousands of lives are at stake right now. If we fail to take action now, the consequences could be catastrophic. And as Premier, it's my duty to act. As Premier, it falls on me to make the difficult but necessary decisions. And I will never, ever shy away from my duty to protect the people of Ontario. This province-wide shutdown, it's a temporary but one-time measure in response to the exceptional circumstances we're facing. We're asking all Ontarians to stay at home and only leave when absolutely necessary, such as work, groceries, prescriptions, or medical appointments. The CBC's Megan Fitzpatrick is following developments in Ontario for us today, and she has details about the upcoming lockdown. Premier Doug Ford announcing a province-wide lockdown to go into effect on December 26th at 12.01 a.m. It will be a 14-day lockdown for the northern parts of the province, a 28-day lockdown for the southern parts of the province. That means a closure of non-essential businesses. Grocery stores, pharmacies can stay open, but other stores uh, closed for shopping indoors. It also means the closure of restaurants and personal care services, gyms and fitness studios, no organized indoor social gatherings. Uh, a lot of restrictions being imposed on parts of the province that aren't already in lockdown. Toronto, for example, has already been in lockdown for a month. Uh, now, in terms of what will happen with schools after the holiday break, the government announcing that on January 4th, all students in the province will shift to remote learning for at least one week. Then on January 11th in Northern Ontario, students can go back to class in both elementary and high school, but in the Southern parts of the province, just elementary school students. High school students will be shifting to remote learning until January 25th. Now, Premier Doug Ford saying he knows that this province-wide lockdown will have a serious effect on businesses, and he did announce some more financial assistance for affected business owners. Uh, but he's saying these are necessary, tough decisions because of the rising case numbers. He said he will always listen to the experts, uh, the medical experts. Some medical experts, however, were calling for stricter lockdown measures and for them to be implemented urgently. So we'll be watching for a reaction today to this announcement from Premier Doug Ford. Megan Fitzpatrick, CBC News, Toronto.